This video will cover difficult questions part 2 regarding the topic of recognized limit as derivative. Question 1. We can rewrite as limit as h approaches 0, 1 over 1 plus h squared minus 1 over h equals limit h approaches 0 1 over 1 plus h squared minus 1 over 1 squared over h. The reason for changing the shape of the number like this is that these two come from the same function. Use the definition of the derivative f prime of a equals limit as h approaches 0 f of a plus h minus f of a over h. When we compare these two limits, we know that a equals 1, so we can rewrite as f prime of 1 equals limit as h approaches 0, f of 1 plus h minus f of 1 over h. So f of 1 plus h is 1 over 1 plus h squared and f of 1 equals 1 over 1 squared that means f of x equals 1 over x squared this limit represents f of prime of 1 where f of x equals 1 over x squared. In power form, f of x equals x to the power of minus 2, then f of prime of x equals minus 2, x to the power of minus 3. We can rewrite as minus 2 over x cubed. Then f of prime of 1 equals minus 2 over 1 cubed. The final answer is minus 2. Question 2. In here, 3 equals 3 to the power of 1 equals 3 to the power of right at any instead of 1. Use the property of logarithmic function to change the place of these two numbers e to the power of ln 3. Back to the original limit. As h approaches 0, e to the power of ln 3 plus h minus 3, which is e to the power of ln 3 over h. Use the definition of the derivative f prime of a equals limit as h approaches 0, f of a plus h minus f of a over h. When we compare these two limits, a is ln3, so we can rewrite as f prime of ln3 equals f of ln3 plus h minus f of ln3 over h. That means f of ln3 plus h is this one e to the power of ln3 plus h f of ln3 equals e to the power of ln3 that means f of x equals e to the power of x so this limit represents f of prime of ln3 where f of x equals e to the power of x, then f of prime of x equals the same thing, e to the power of x, then f of prime of ln3 is e to the power of ln3. We can change these two numbers. 3 to the power of ln e is 3 to the power of 1. The final answer is 3. Question 3 for prime of a equals 
limit that's delta x approaches 0 f of a plus delta x minus f of a over delta x when we compare these two limits a is 1 then f of prime of 1 is limit as delta x approaches 0 f of 1 plus delta x minus f of 1 over delta x so f of 1 plus delta x is the first part 5 minus 3 times 1 plus delta x so f of 1 equals 5 minus 3 times 1 which is 2 so f of 1 is 2 that means f of x equals 5 minus 3x that means this limit represents f of prime of 1 where f of x is 5 minus 3x then f of prime of x equals minus 3 in here f of prime of x is a constant function that means no matter the value of x f of prime of x is always minus 3 so f of prime of 1 equals minus 3 so final answer is minus 3 question 4 another expression in the definition of the derivative is f of prime of a is limit as x approaches a f of x minus f of a over x minus a when we compare these two limits x minus a is x minus 1 that means a is 1 so we can rewrite as f of prime of 1 equals limit as x approaches 1 f of x minus f of 1 over x minus 1 that means f of x is these two x to the power of 4 plus x then f of 1 equals 1 to the power of 4 plus 1 which is 2 this is f of 1 so this limit represents f of prime of 1 where f of x is x to the power of 4 plus x then f of prime of x is 4x cubed plus 1 then f of prime of 1 is 4 times 1 cubed plus 1 the answer is 4 plus 1 which is 5 the final answer is 5. This is the last one. Use the definition of the derivative. f prime of a is limit as x approaches a f of x minus f of a over x minus a. When we compare these two limits, x minus 6 is x minus a, that means a is 6 so we can rewrite as f of prime of 6 is limit as x approaches 6 f of x minus f of 6 over x minus 6 then back to the original we can rewrite as limit as x approaches 6 minus x squared minus minus 36 over x minus 6 so f of x is minus x squared then f of 6 is minus 6 squared which is minus 36 so this limit represent f of prime of 6 where f of x is minus x squared then f of prime of x 
is minus 2x. Then f of prime of 6 is minus 2 times 6, which is minus 12. So final answer is minus 12. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.